Hello, welcome to Phoenix Point as we continue to try and save humanity. Before we begin our help of this haven here, we're going to level up Jacob. Strong man, gain heavy weapons proficiency. Well, we're not going to be doing heavy weapons with him. Thief. I know that we want that right now. He's going to be a split between assault and tech. So tech will be his second class level, which we don't have access to right now. So instead, what we're going to do is we're going to um, increase the speed 18. Bring his willpower up. And we'll leave it at that. And that was it, right? Yep. But let's check. Oh, Sophia is out of ammo. Hmm. Could reload that, but no, we're going to go ahead and. What is this? Oh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why I was looking at that and was thinking it was in her inventory. So, okay. Why? Oh, because of stamina. Stamina. Like, why is that red exclamation mark there? Okay, so she's good. Grenade. We could go ahead and give her this. Because she has 16. Let's do that. Because we want, we do want to give her that anyway. Um, okay. And he's got a grenade. He's got two grenades. Grenade. Grenade. I'd like to give her two grenades, but too late to be trying to make a grenade in time for the mission so okay they should be good to go so it's nighttime yeah it's supposed to be harder at nighttime I don't know doesn't seem to really be that much difference to me um, defending strength of four I guess that means that they have they'll have four soldiers on the battlefield We'll get a plus eight Sanhedrin approval, plus 15 people. And there's seven that we need to kill, I think is what that means. And we'll get this as a reward. So let's start the mission. All items in the battlefield will be automatically recovered. Cavalry to the rescue. We hope. <laughs> Haven defense mission. Structure defense. Defeat all enemy forces before they damage the key structures of the Haven. You can take control of Haven defenders by moving next to them if you wish. One surviving Haven defender may volunteer to join Phoenix. Okay. So I'm thinking we probably don't see anything. Nope. So we're going to need to defend this there. Well, that's probably going to be destroyed over here. Whatever's over here. This, yeah. I don't know if we'll be able to get over there and save that. Save that. So, okay. Four items we need to save, all in the perimeter. So 
So she has the most armor, so we're just going to jump. See if we get sights on anything. So I think for her, we're going to jump over here. Watch this. And we don't see anything. Rolling out. Move here. Okay. Very good. Then we'll come over here to Omar. And I think in his case, we're going to jump up here. There we go. Wait, does he have a gun? No. Yeah, I was going to say, they none of them have, should have a gun, so should be good, actually. Okay, I'll move over here. We're not going to really get a shot at him. But I think we come over here and we set up a um, Overwatch. Oh, we heard something inside the door here. Oh. Oh. Well, that's not good because <laughs> we're not killing all three of those. Ready. So that what that means is that he's going to get whack, he's going to get hit on. Yeah, see I mean even with this generation tour so it's about as much as we can get in there let's see if that comes with this yes of course did I just did I not just up uh, no yeah didn't I just um Level her up is reduced by one action because normally it took three. It's okay. I'll be right there. So there's no way we're going to kill all three of those when they come. They're, they're probably going to come and attack him. Receiving. And I don't know what's in here. That'll probably come running out through here. So uh, this may have all been. Oh, and now there's a fourth one. <laughs> all right. Sure. Whatever. So we're just going going to um, set up overwatches. Watch them all dance around the side of this. Watch this guy go. Oh, oh, oh I know where your Overwatch cone is. These guys go. Oh, I, we know where your Overwatch cone is. And we're gonna set up this Overwatch. And I'm not making it, you know, way out here to cover them, actually. 
because we don't want them we don't want to be wasting bullets on trees and other things whenever they move past those area covered so again that's not it that will not eliminate whoever that is those guys it won't eliminate them we'll put this here well maybe we won't go through because again we don't have to worry about them having any weapons at this time area covered probably should have moved her Do I still have somebody who can move? Why why do I Here. why did it not go immediately to end turn like it normally does? Hmm. Yep. Okay, I was gonna say yep. See oh okay, yeah. Yeah whatever. Oh oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yeah, of course. Oh, oh my goodness. You kidding me with the blocks. What a joke. What a joke. So, yeah, we wasted all of our Overwatch. All of our every single bullet, well, except for some of his, went into walls and other obstacles. What a joke. What a stinking joke. But okay. All right. Got five will points left. So I'm going to move here. Shoot you in the face for punching me. And then I'm going to run back over here. Hmm. Yeah, as usual with her short moves, uh, she's kind of pointless. On this map, anyway. I mean, if we had longer shots, but again, we saw a longer shot where she missed, so it's like she needs a better weapon with a better aiming reticle. Thinking we we ought to be able to move into here, get one of these guys, but but no, I don't know. Going to climb the stairs the next turn, probably, and try to attack him. Though they, they may be actually just going for the piece of equipment, I don't know. But we'll, we'll toss a grenade down here. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, okay. See now, so the game's cheesing me. 
I mean, I guess that's a smart move. By moving here, so I can't move here really, because I risk if I throw a grenade there of taking out this out and then killing myself because I fall through the floor. Yes. So okay, maybe we do this. No, see, then, then we're not going. Okay, there we go. Got them both. Should get them both. If it doesn't, I'm going to be highly disappointed. Bleeding 20. Bleeding 20 has 140 hit points. Yeah, this is where I wish I had a melee weapon. Why can't I make a melee weapon? The fact that I can't make a melee weapon is, is really kind of silly, in my opinion. Like, what, just because the world went into um, decline that suddenly we forgot how to make a big wooden mallet or carve a branch into a big club? I mean, come on. Why, why can't I make a melee unit? I think if I go here. So 350 damage. It's 110. But probably will not hit all of those. So that's a pretty small reticle though. So maybe. Okay, I'm going to go here. Where is it? Isn't there another one over here? There, 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 and there. Okay, I'm gonna hop down here. Very good. Move out here so we can jump next turn. She can only move there. Okay. Okay, I think we come over here. I'm prepared. And I think you come here. You come here, and then we'll set up Overwatch through here. Nothing's getting yeah, me. and so they'll run here, and she'll shoot this thing. Just making my predictions. Okay, we'll set this up here. In case they come out through the doors, the windows at this, Area these coming. two. And I think we do a war cry. That impacts four different guys there. Then we'll move here. Here's a kinetic argument. All right, reinforcements. Looks like they're the calf. <laughs> Thought I was the calf. No, I was the one getting ambushed. Let's resolve this.
Okay, so I actually heard. That's that's who I heard down there. Think of it as reverse solidarity. <laughs> Well, my prediction was wrong. Did not shoot that thing, but they are kind of controlling my my moves here. Which is not good, right? At the battlefield, I should be the one controlling the battlefield, but they're kind of dictating some of my moves, which is not good. So I think we're going to move here and then blast him. Come get some. That allows him to take a heal. So we may not have needed that. Okay, yeah, then I think we're just going to have him do Overwatch. Need to try and bring her up so she has a vision field moving in quick so you know more of a field of vision so maybe she can shoot further down the the street there the angle gonna move her here moving in quick so we can get control of this guy sniper up there no, I don't know what this guy is yeah a sniper but he's got a pistol Oh, because he took that. Yeah, he took the sniper shot and then he took a pistol shot. Yeah. If I come out here, though. What does 180 damage? If he hits with every shot, he should be able to kill this guy. Already there. I've got this. No. Two blood sucking arms. Would be good to take out the regeneration. Let's do that. Yeah. Okay, very good. I don't know what's there. But without... If 
It's not a melee weapon. It's kind of like would look because I would like to jump down there and then and then smack him. But nothing we're gonna be able to do. Okay, I don't know. Set them up for later. Ready, willing, and able. Just move down here. Move back here. Do an overwatch. Do an overwatch. Do an overwatch. Uh, another fun day in Hell World. Opening fire. Nice. Let's lower the threat level. Nice. I don't, I don't know what that was, but she hit though. That was that dude. Well, you know, at least uh, hit one of them and not me. Ready. Rolling out. Give her another kill. Is this really the best they can do? All right. Lots of people leveling up. Killed all enemies. And no structures were damaged. But I guess we got lucky though with the way we loaded in where we were right there where the enemy were. If they if the enemy had come in around the edge of the map, we we probably would have lost some structures or they would have suffered some serious damage. Okay, Haven saved. And we've got 100 tick, 420 mats, and 180 food. Okay. Now let's set the Pandoran's behavior is revealed the location of their colony. A new Pandoran nest site is visible in the geoscope view and may now be targeted for attack. Okay. Pandoran colonies have a chance to be revealed after a successful Haven defense mission. The more times the colony attacks, the greater the chance of it being revealed. If a Pandoran colony attacks from within the scanning range of a Phoenix base, it will be revealed immediately. Okay. Yes, let's replenish all. Can we add? No. All right. I'd like to go ahead and get this while they still have not um, mutated to have any weapons. But in the meantime, let's do our level ups. So for our snipers, so for her, we, we do want quick aim. This is the one I thought that I had just chosen, you know, that gives us a reduction of one of the proficient weapon. But obviously that was not the case. And we're gonna give her some more willpower because this takes three will points to use. 
So we're going to beef up her willpower there. Everything is good here. Yes, we're going to give him return fire. And then, because that this takes three, so we want what more than so this will allow him to use this four times. So we'll give him one more so that he has he'll have one will point left. So we won't use it four times and immediately go into panic mode. I think we're going to go ahead and give, well, let's see, Omar, let's, yeah. I think we're going to give him a biochemist. Go ahead and do that. Now, Sophia, she's going to be um, an, infilt we don't, an infiltrator as her second class, and we don't have that available. So we're going to go ahead and give her another willpower. Hmm. Maybe the speed. Yeah. Jacob. I think we don't really do anything for him this time. And I don't think that he was ready for a level up anyway. So we're going to give her Brawler. And we're going to give her some more strength. Let's see, her jump pack takes three right so we want to be able to have at least one will point left whenever she jumps we're going to give her another strength we'll use some of our phoenix skill points there and that should be it and we are going to attack this but what i need to do I want to wait till we manufacture this grenade. The other thing I, I forgot we should be doing is we should have been building one of these. So we're going to put that into the queue because this will be important to our strategy of how we approach the um, scavenge, scavenging missions. So we should have been building that quite a while back. Um, I don't know. Should I? I'm hesitant to be buying any, uh, or buying, making any more equipment or armor at this point when we when we may not need to. So here we're still doing our repairs. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and hope this isn't an ambush so that we don't get caught in. We're just waiting for that grenade to be made. War exploration site. This valley was a location of a major battle of the Third World War. The ground is poisoned and thousands of skeletons now overgrown by muta mutated moss litter the countryside. There is absolutely nothing of value here. Okay, very good. Complete. Very good. So now we come back in here. 
And we give Sophia back her... the ammo so yes she already has this ammo yep okay very good what it's already been here why are you still showing an exclamation mark Attack Pandora Nest. So we will get positive attitude changes from everybody and we'll get eight additional populations somewhere, I guess. Threat level medium. Warning, be aware of the Pandoran defense system. Sentinels will trigger if a soldier is in its sensor range or attacks them. Eggs will hatch if a soldier gets close. Continuous attack. Yes, we already know. Enemy reinforcements will arrive continuously from areas marked with a symbol. So we're not going to start that because we're not going to have time to finish it. So we'll go ahead and we'll cut this episode here. And then whenever we come back for our next episode, we will run this Pandoran base mission. So hopefully you enjoyed this quick little episode. And... You'll come back and join us when we continue. Remember, if you have any comments, suggestions, uh, criticisms, ideas, etc., please feel free to leave them in the comments. And I will consider them as always. Until next time, have a perfectly great day.